Assalamu alaikum. My name is uh, Rahim Akbar. I'm from Karachi, Pakistan. I've been doing woodworking for about four years now. Uh, I'm doing it because it's uh, my family tradition to do this stuff. My grandfather used to make mosques in Pakistan and I'm now carrying his legacy and trying to reproduce this work over here in the States. Uh, I do work in wood and I use different techniques for stain and cutting and uh, applique work style. I've made mosques in Los Angeles, Connecticut, um, North Carolina and uh, I want to continue this work and uh, bring this art form to people living in West and Muslims to show them their heritage and uh, give them an ability to appreciate the art form of Islamic world. People uh, from all walks of life are coming to this festival and they're appreciating all kind of artwork. They like the woodwork because uh, it's very traditional to find it in the Islamic world from Morocco, Egypt, Spain to Alhambra uh, and it holds a very key role in the Islamic world. Any work takes around from uh, three months to two month time period. It's very painstaking. It takes a lot of time, a lot of patience and uh, it it takes about a month to finish a piece. Takriban tamam communities se taluk rakhne wale logon ki ek badi tadad yaha maujood thi. I'm exhibiting with my daughter Amina ke saath. Um, organized by Dr. Azim who brought us in. It's a mother-daughter effort, or a mother-daughter team. Ke saath se kaam kar rahe. The um, her work is in glass, mine is in acrylics and mixed inks. Or um, I painted for a long time, but she is new to her medium. And um, the series is called Subhana Tala, and it's an inspiration based on nature and God's glory in nature as well as God's uh, supremacy on the earth and for us human beings. Uh, my work is based on nature and Allah, Allah's glory in nature. Hum, as human beings, we can do very little for it. But you see the colors in the sky or pani mein khubsurti or... So, um, there is a effort hai on my part to bring it to everybody to see what I feel, yeah, what it does for me as an artist. But um, basically for the past few months it's been therapy for both of us. We work together, we go to the studio together, she works, and we pray together and we thank him a lot. My name is Salman Jalali and uh, I try to be poet. <laughs> so these things, you know, inspire a poet very nicely because these are Islamic uh, cultural and Islamic uh, art. And I'm so glad they have wonderful display of all the different types of oil painting and handmade and it's wonderful. It's an ex ex excellent experience to watch with this uh, well, very, very well organized event. Uh, and like uh, I told that uh, it inspires me to find out uh, the Islamic heritage uh, for the uh, arts of uh, this kind. And every stall is so managed and so inspiring and so nice that I was very glad. So congratulations to the management who have done that. My name is Amina Schwak. I am a glass artist. I've been working with glass for over 10 years. Um, and I'm very blessed to be part of this festival among all these other amazing artists. Uh, my inspiration is just uh, doing abstract contemporary work. I like modern pieces and glass is an amazing medium that allows light to transfer through. And I feel that that really allows you to capture um, a, a, amazing religious types of messages and so I, I try to use my work um, in, a, in a religious way it, it's more meaningful to me um, to do that 
This is one of my favorite pieces. Um, it shows waves moving, um, and that's the, that's what it's meant to be. It's an abstract form, and then uh, the the sea floor. It's got dimension to it, and uh, the word Allah in calligraphy, just to make it all seamless. Or, for example, this Kaaba piece, um, which is all it's all solid glass melted together. The it shows um, Haji's dots. That's what the colored pieces are meant to uh, show. So my inspiration is just um, trying to glorify God. I think that that's the um, the, the main goal um, in my work, and um, I, I'm very blessed to be able to do it. Assalamualaikum. My name is Hina. Um, I've been passionate about art pretty much my whole life. I started with like coloring books, so I've always been interested in art. And just recently, I got interested in Islamic art. I really love Islamic calligraphy and architecture. So um, I started exploring that in my artwork, and um, I was actually just looking for a platform where I could feel good about my art and do art with a purpose. So I created a company called Celebrate Islam. And um, with my company, I make custom-made uh, custom Islamic art, and I donate 25% to Islamic causes. Um, and to our local masjid. So um, that's my inspiration behind my art. Um, I want to do art with a purpose. So um, as far as like the media that I use, um, I'm kind of all over the place. I love exploring with different um, media. So I do watercolor, I do markers, I do acrylic oils, um, pretty much everything. So I just love art, I'm really passionate about it, and I love doing different types of art. This is an amazing event. They did such a great job um, setting it up. It was so organized, and inshallah they'll continue to do it, and I'll definitely be a part of it, but this was amazing. इस तरह की तकरीबात के इनेकाद से अमेरिका में मुसलमानों का एक सॉफ्ट इमेज तर्तीब पाता है और मुख्तलिफ कम्युनिटीज में हम आहंगी पैदा करने में मदद मिलती है। अस्सलाम वालेकुम मेरा नाम जफर ताहिर है और मेरे साथ मेरी वाइफ यास्मीन मौजूद हैं कुकी मुझे बेंता खुशी है और मैं टीवी वन का शुक्रिया दा करन और ये एक बहुत बड़ी बात है मैं समझता हूँ दिस इज़ अ ह्यूज स्टेप के ह्यूस्टन में एक इस्लामिक सोसाइटी ऑफ ग्रेटर ह्यूस्टन की मस्जिद में एक सेंटर में आज हम एक इस्लामिक आर्ट्स फेस्टिवल कर रहे हैं और ये मेरे ख़ास एक बहुत अच्छा कदम है इसकी वजह से जो इस्लाम का एक सॉफ्ट इमेज जो है हमारे फेलो अमेरिकन के सामने आएगा उनको पता चलेगा कि हम आर्ट में भी इंटरेस्टेड हैं हम जो हमारे ट्रेडिशनल चीज़ें हैं उनको डिपिट करने में इंटरेस्टेड हैं कैलिग्राफी जो है वो एक बहुत बड़ी चीज़ है इस्लाम में तो इन सब चीज़ों से जो इमेज उभरेगा इस्लाम का मुसलमानों का पाकिस्तानी अमेरिकन्स का मुस्लिम अमेरिकन्स का वो इंतहा पॉजिटिव होगा और मैं बेनतहा खुश हूँ और मैं चाहूँगा कि ऐसी चीज़ें और होती रहें और एक बार फिर टी वी का बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया And I actually started painting about a year and a half ago. Um, it was a month before I started law school and I wanted to do something fun before starting the journey of law school. So I decided I wanted to um, paint some things for my room and for the house. So um, I just went on YouTube and I looked up how to paint. And um, I bought some canvases and I practiced on them and I, and I found out I was actually pretty good at it. So I decided to make some more and for my family and they like them and I didn't start painting Islamic artwork about uh, until about um, a year ago maybe. Um, this is actually, this is the one that was the first painting that I ever made and, um, and I started selling my artwork about six months ago. The response has been so wonderful. And I, um, I'm so grateful for the opportunity to make the artwork and to, um, you know, spread it in Houston. So it's been incredible.
name is Asad Abbas. I'm a physician, I'm an eye doctor. And I just started doing some, some oil paintings. So based on this, uh, Azim called me and said there was an art festival going on. And he asked me if I had something, and I didn't. So that's, that's how it started. Um, I've always done sketchings, but, but not oils really. And it's the first time I'm doing it. So, so it's just been fun. It's very, it's inspiring to see all the talent that's here. It's, it's just wonderful. My inspiration is just Islamic art. It's, I've, I've been uh, looking at some cal calligraphy and some old Islamic art. And Sufism is uh, something that I've been into. And just the Kaaba itself is just such, such a wonderful place. And I just thought I'd do, do that to begin with. But uh, I've really enjoyed this. And just seeing other people's arts inspire, inspires you. People who are better than you. So um, that's always positive. So, and I'm, I'm glad this has gone on. I hope they continue doing this every year. फेस्टिवल का मकसद जहां ह्यूस्टन में मौजूद मुसलमान आर्टिस्टों को सामने लाना था वहां इस्लामी तारीख के مختلف ادوار में परवान चढ़ने वाले आर्ट को भी प्रमोट करना था I'm Barbara Mitchell. I'm here because uh, friends and neighbors that I did some work with invited me here today, and I'm absolutely delighted with it. It's just beautiful, and I hope you'll do this again. I really do. Um, a couple of years ago, the library at which I work invited this Majid to work with us as we brought in a collection of books on Islam um, through a grant with the National Endowment for the Humanities. And I'm back here today and hoping that some of the artists will work with me to display their work in the library coming next year. 